Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your computer is continuously, infinitely booting into safe mode when you're trying to get back into the normal Windows operating system. So this should be a pretty quick tutorial and we're going to jump right into it. And even though I'm in the normal Windows operating mode, you'll still be able to do this if you're stuck within the safe mode. So don't think because you can see I have a desktop here that this tutorial will not work for you because this tutorial is designed if you are stuck in safe mode. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu. And you want to type in msconfig. And the best match that comes up should say system configuration directly above the desktop app. So you want to left click on that one time to open it up. And now you want to go and left click on the boot tab right here. Underneath boot options, if safe mode is currently checkmarked here, you want to uncheck it. So uncheck that. As well as going back to the general tab right here, you want to either have selective startup or normal startup. If diagnostic startup is selected here, you want to move your mouse and you want to tap in the circle for normal startup right here. Or like I said, for selective startup, whichever one you prefer, more, most people should just be normal startup here. And then once you've done that, and then you've made sure under boot that safe boot is unchecked, you want to click on apply and OK. It'll say you may need to restart your computer to apply these changes. Before restarting, save any open files and close all programs. I'd recommend restarting your computer, and then hopefully your computer should boot back into the normal Windows 10 operating system. So, I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching, and I will catch you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.